The sun is hot, but did you know the core is over 27 million degrees Fahrenheit? While the surface is just 10,000 degrees Fahrenheit. Why is the center so much hotter? Well, it's because the sun is a giant nuclear fusion reactor. At its core, literally crushing hydrogen atoms together under intense pressure and gravity to form helium, releasing immense energy. But why does this only happen in the core? And why is the surface so much cooler? We'll tell you how the sun works right after. Key point one, the source of the sun's heat. The sun's core is a nuclear fusion reactor. Here, hydrogen atoms are crushed together under intense pressure and gravity to form helium, releasing immense energy. This only happens in the core because it's where the temperature and pressure are extreme enough. Key point two, gravity equals pressure equals heat. The sun's massive gravity pulls everything inward, creating incredible pressure in the core. This pressure heats the gas up to 15 million degrees Fahrenheit. That's 10 times hotter than the surface. And the deeper you go into the sun, the higher the density and temperature. Key point three, fusion Vs. Fire, the sun isn't burning like fire. It's fusing atoms together. This releases millions of times more energy than chemical fire. Key point four, why the surface is cool. The sun's outer layers are cooler because by the time the energy reaches them, it's spread out. The light and heat we see is just the last stage of energy escaping from the core. And now for the bonus twist. The sun's outer atmosphere, the corona, is actually hotter than the surface. How can this be? No one is 100% sure, but scientists think it may have to do with magnetic waves or plasma effects. So the sun's temperature isn't as simple as you think. Next time you look at the sun, remember, it's not just a ball of fire in the sky. It's a fusion engine powered by gravity and time. For more videos, science and history, follow our channel. Thanks.